Good morning, two kid. What up? It is Cocaine. I'm Rob. I am here to vandalize Foxy's BattleTech Advanced streams. Um, with my own stream of Rogue Tech, I just decided I'm going to be doing some of these randomly. This is not going to be a scheduled show. Um, I'm awake. I've taken two caffeine pills. Uh, I am ready to go. With some of this Rogue Tech, I wanted to be able to show the difference between BTA and Rogue Tech and kind of do my own thing. And uh, we're going to ride hard and deep with the Van Zant Militia. Um, I just want to have some fun. And, you know, you need to keep that good morning line whenever someone does a BT stream. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> it's it's on. I guess it's recorded now. Dude, yeah, you used all your goob drowning me yesterday. What are you going to do today? Anyway, Cocaine and Rob here to to hijack. I'm going to pirate the pirate radio here before Diggs and Bowser wake up. Um, uh, we're going to start a fresh career in Rogue Tech. And I'll be playing this on and off. Yep, there's the hydrate. I'll be playing this on and off the stream. Like, you're going to see the start today. And then you're going to see, like, you might see several missions later the next time I come on. This is just going to be, like, my singular Rogue Tech game. But I'm not going to do, like, restarts. Like, if I blow up, I'm going to blow, like, I I will let it blow up. So I'll be playing rather conservatively. Um, you'll also, you might hear some of my Discord notifications. I am going to be keeping those up currently, just in case I get a ping from Bowser or Diggs or something. Like, hey, knock it off, butthole. But for now, can somebody redeem a DFA for <laughs> Uh, for now, 
I used all my goo yeah, that's why. I'm I'm doing it because I know that you're uh, goob impotent right now, Foxy. Um, for right now, I just wanted to give the East Coast guys something for the morning, getting to work, getting your coffee, something to watch. We're going to go about two hours, about two hours. And for our round the world, our Euro guys, something to close out the workday, something to watch uh, kind of as you go, listen to if you're driving home, don't watch and drive. Uh, and then if for our Aussie guys around the world, Aussie guys and gals, um, you know, a little bit of uh, a little bit of fresh content there as well, something for to end the end the day. Um, and also, you'll notice my new avatar uh, that is Cocaine Scarface Rob in the top. Uh, actually, looks a pretty good likeness of me. Um, yeah, someone mentioning you. Yes, my round the world friend. Anyway, hi Whip, hi Chaotic, hi Bully, hi hi Blue Gent, hi Cake Boss. We're all here. Uh, we're just going to have a nice, chill little time for a couple hours. Um, it looks like everything's functioning. And I'm going to turn... I'm going to adjust some, some difficulties here. So I like to do six because I, I kind of like the immersion of... A, you need a head, a torso, two legs, two arms. So I like to do that. I like to bring the Ronin chance down a little bit. Just because I want them to feel a little more special. But I like starting money. So that if I want to, I can like fuck around with some stuff. I like to have my commander not suck. Uh, I like 10% for the shop selling prices, what you what you get out of selling your gear, because 10% is a nicer number than 13%, and I'm weird like that. Um, I do bring the exponent for the level costs uh, down, because otherwise your guys just go so slow, and it feels a little harsh when they die. Um, as stated, we are going to go with... We're not going to go with Rusty Dan... Um, we're going to go with a malicious start, because we're going to be playing as Van Zan, basically. We're just going to be going for that money. Um, good morning, Lord Troa. Yeah, it's about 8... Oh, it's 8.50 a.m. right now for me, actually. Um, so, yeah. Like I said, we're going to give this a couple hours. I don't change the payment, but I like to make salvage generous, because stuff is fun. And I'm here to have fun. And you guys want to have fun, I'm sure, watching it. Uh, advanced Mech Warriors, we're just going to do them normal. Uh, we are going to do the Ronin Start. Uh, that's a configurable option in Rogue Tech that you do before you start the game. Uh, I'll bring the pilots down to four. That makes them a little bit... You kind of have to work with what you get that way. But at the same time, like I said, I like them to have better progression and that by i do that by lowering that multiplier um c bills i don't like to change how much it costs i don't like to change the speeds uh the scrap return values uh i do that to 10 percent as well again because i'm just anal retentive about the numbers so my overall difficulty is a little bit easier than the intended experience 0.69 difficulty no i'm i'm just gonna do it like this this is this is how i like to set it up i think it makes for a fun game salvage is good salvage is where the money is in in all of these two so this is gonna take a minute you'll see it's got batches and pending and processing i'm running this with a 96 gig page file um and 48 gigs of ram so this is like my first time since my upgrade of, you know, kind of saying, okay, let's see how my computer, my rig, handles this with it now upgraded. And I'm sorry if you, I'm, I'm still a little stuffy. It's allergy season in Michigan, so you might have to bear with that a bit. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> yo, yo. You'll notice, like, these. These are really funny in uh, BTA and in... Um, in Rogue Tech, because there's a lot of pretty great lines they've put uh, they've put in there, the teams, and of course we're we're gonna be making Randolph P. Checkers our commander, <laughs> just for the record. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, hang on, I'm gonna. Well, this loads. I'm going to turn my uh, 
steam on the do not disturb. Don't worry, we're still we're still going. I just don't want to. Oh, excuse me. I don't want that popping up where people can see it. That's that's not quite right. So I'm just gonna toss that card up. Code dog. Yeah, what up, dude? Yep, fellow gander right here, buddy. Let me make sure I didn't cause this to crash. <laughs> Nobody can... No, we can't stop you. You're right. There we go. We brought that back around. Duck Amanda. Yeah, we're, I, I like to do the... Because that way I get the text voice. And I really like the voice pack he did. Yeah, the mods really make this game great. I played vanilla... I played vanilla when it was vanilla. And like didn't even have any DLC. And then I played it again when all the DLC was out. And I beat it both times. And I said, alright. Never doing vanilla again. And not because it's bad. Just because I like more. Also, welcome to the chat, Raw. What up? Thank you. Hi. Thanks for coming by. Yeah, dude, I, I like the allergies more, too, Troa. That's why I live in Michigan and not Florida. Like, <laughs> or anywhere else. I, I find the weather here excellent. Oh, my God, we got Grandpa text portrait right away. Ha! Anyway, like a good Randolph P. Checkers, we're going to be from the deep periphery. Uh, we're gonna be a history nerd because tech's history nerd. And, um, cause it's either that or we just, like, find the one that's, like, uh, you know, drunk. <laughs> uh, but anyway, history, and then we'll be a freelancer. Yeah, there it is. Quirk, reckless and drunk. And you get a random hunchback. So now let us set this up. Like I said, hopefully a lot of this runs pretty quick. Um, try not to take too much time and set up. Yeah, you get hot and allergies. Yucks. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> yeah, my day's just starting. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, there we go. He, Mr. I'm on the clock. What do you want? I'll probably turn those voices up a little bit. They get a little bit disparate so it uh don't want it to mix that tech the call sign is just going to be tex randolph p checkers and of course i'm going to go for the text portrait that i like just because we're gonna we're just gonna lean into it all we're gonna lean into the whole van zant thing because why not and we're gonna make decisions Based on what I think Van Zantians would do. So they will be insane decisions. Except, like I said, I'm going to play a little conservative just because I don't want to be in constant restarts. And I'm not going to... I if I Like I said, if I blow up, I will, I will start fresh. And that will just be the lot of life. Oh boy. Let me sit up a little bit, find this picture because I always, I always miss it. I'm just like, oh, where to go? Oh. It's also one of my favorite ones, to be fair. Like, I love using it. If I can ever find it. Vans, yeah, they're insane, not stupid. They have the cap of face. Insane. Oh my god. They've done so much with this. I really I really admire the work put in. I try not to hang around on the dis their Discord too much, but I do like the work they've put in. It's very impressive. One of you has definitely seen that picture like three times already, and you're probably like just reading silently and just like, Rob, you're so stupid and blind. And I'd be like, you're correct on both fronts. Like, these are objectively true statements. 
there's a text portrait. That is one of them. There it is. This is my favorite one because it's hilarious. And confirm. Thank you, Zin. <laughs> Uh, Zin's like, Rob, fuck. <laughs> All right. Well, first things first, we're just going to hit this really quick. Um, do, do, do. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, somebody subbed with Prime. Mech Angel. Aeus? Mech Angel, thank you for that sub. Much appreciated. The Van Zandt Militia. Here we go. There is one specific... You're going to hate me. You are going to hate me. Because there is one specific... Again, there is one specific icon I love to use. No one's going to be like, play game! <laughs> but no, I need my icon. I, I need to feel at home with my, my company. There it is. There's my boy. Friendly fire. Because <laughs> we have allied friendly fire on. And boy howdy, are we going to use it. We are going to friendly fire the shit out of ourselves. Oh, yes, Foxy. Foxy, you are correct. Um, oh, Zinthar, give me a hydrate. Thank you. Foxy is B doing BTA on Saturdays now. Um, for anything you can do for free for the BPL, thank you. Hey, it still matters. It still counts, and we still appreciate you. Um, and I understand that free aspect for show. Um... Yeah, friendly flamers. Not, not so friendly sometimes. But uh, like Foxy said in here, plug in him on Saturday. He and Ralphie will be doing BT on Saturdays now. Um, and I strongly encourage you to check out their playthrough. It's very good. They're having a good time. Um, and messing with a different version of the mods. And I think that's really interesting to see the dichotomy between the two. So first thing I always do. No matter what, I repair the power conduits. Because it takes away a lot of the awful shit. It is war crime o'clock for real. But we have to see what kind of mechs we have to know what kind of war crimes we will commit. Which will happen shortly, because we're going to look at our pilots. We're going to be like, what did we get? Who did we take? Ready for orders. We have this guy. He seems fun. We'll give him... Tactics and piloting right out the gate. Confirm that Training up. Training confirmed, Commander. Corsair. He is a dual pilot, so he'll do mechs and vix. I'm receiving you. We have Ek. I always try to go piloting and tactics right off the ba Training bat if complete. somebody's got... Uh, you can rename pilots if they aren't Kickstarter portraits or Ronin. So, like, we have Thank mostly Lord. Ronin right now. So, like, this one I can probably rename because I don't think it's, uh... Oh, no, this is, this is, um, somebody from the team. This is probably somebody from the Rogue Tech team then because it's a random portrait, but they've locked the, um, they've locked the ability to generate stuff on it. So I would wager it's a, a mod team member. Mech Warrior training complete. Normally you can, Zen. Normally you can. Um, if they're if they're just completely randomized. So we've got a version of Glitch. We've got Ek Corsair. Slapdash. Not sure who this is. But we'll just pump those points in there. Training confirmed, Commander. Yeah, I don't know if that was her portrait or not from the campaign. It's been a while, Foxy. Yeah, no, I do I do remember Glitch. I just don't rem I don't remember. Commander? This must be the modded in version or something. 
Like, I know they've probably changed it, or maybe they didn't. You know, you guys might remember Drink better than me on that. Or you probably definitely do. Um, oh, is that her straight out? Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. I'm on the clock. What do you want? Let's see here. See, and this, like I said, this is why I start him with a little bit of extra... A little bit of extra XP, because then we can get a nice rounded commander to start. Warrior training um, and then I start specializing. I kind of get everybody to four, get them a baseline, and then I start specializing. Yeah. Oh, wow, this person sucks. And they're a tanker. Well, I'm guess, I guess you're going to blow up in a tank, probably. Wow. Okay. Well. I'm going to put you in something that blows up for sure. Uh, and hope you don't come back. Ugh. Decker was... Oh, no, I don't have Decker. Uh, I never had Decker explode. I don't know. Like, I didn't even understand that meme, Cold. Until other until I like, went online, other people were like, Decker always dies. And I'm like, he does? What? Good to go. Steep uh I'm tempted here. I'm I'm tempted to take What do you need? The extra pilot here. What's up, boss? Extra mech pilot. I think I think I will. Right out the gate, New grab a pilot. Available. Crossfade, that would have been a funny one for me to take. The Argo with its friendly fire logo. I love it. So things that are in the hall here. We're in, like it says, we're in Davian space. There's a light VTOL. It's just a chopper. It would probably blow up immediately. Quick cell machine guns. Awesome. Um, as for added mechs to this, I have the stock content plus the Civil War content. And I did not add Jihad or anything further. Because you can break down what gets added. So you have like everything up to 3062. And then I have also added the 3062 mechs. But I didn't let it add Jihad. I didn't let it add Republic. I didn't let it add Dark Age. Because I don't like that stuff um, in my rogue tech. So I don't add it. Simple as. Alright. We're going to advance one day. Because then we get our commander gear. Let's see what they did to my boy. Like it said, we're going to get a hunchback. Good morning, Beerski. You're a beautiful bastard. Behemoth? I, didn't, I don't think I lost Behemoth either. We had a 5J. We'll have to look at what that is. Is there? Yeah, I, ha I think I have that much. I must have that much achievement because I have done it. Thou shalt have coma? Really? Is there an event like that? I didn't even know. Is cleared for fighting. Oh, zombie can be maxed in gut soon. If he lives and gets experience, sure, we'll do that. <laughs> it's a field upgrade kit. All right, time to get to the juicy, juicy, juicy mech Check bits. Out this mech bay, Commander. Pretty great, right? Ooh, that's like not this. good. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I guess the militia group doesn't have a lot of mechs. Whoopsie. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Um, well yeah, it was, it was in rip. <laughs> um at least we have the field upgrade of the uh of the hunchback. Let's see what this boy's got. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, time to brush up on mixed combat for real. Alright, so the no nice thing off the bat is we have a cased up RD5 LRM-10 boat with medium lasers and some pulse lasers. It'll, at the least, give us out the gate a good amount of um, evasion negating ability. We look at the 5J... Uh, double heat sinks, running cooler, 
upgrade to Artemis 4. Case instead of a small laser. Works for me. Works very well for me. I don't mind these armor values as they stand. Um, I mean, there's a lot of room for improvement there. There's plenty of stuff that we'll be able to do there. Nothing we can really mess with now, but at least we've seen it. And let's see what kind of assassin this is and whether or not I yak myself when I look at it. The 21, so I don't have these memorized, obviously. Tank it is, for real. Good morning. Good morning, uh, Raimi. I think I'm just gonna, I think Raimi, I'm gonna say Raimi. It, it's, it's not garbage if you use it right, but this one's garbage because I don't have the parts to use it the way I want to use it. Unfortunately, we don't have a choice. <laughs> Uh, swarm ammo is going to be silly. Uh, the SRM2, the, this is going to be the best weapon on here, and that's sad. Um, so swarm ammo is AOE, very light AOE. Basically, it's going to be mine clearing at that point, because it'll just blow up and be like, pew, pew. Um, man, I hope he's going to, uh, whoever's going to be in this, gonna have to get real good at punching because that's all they're gonna be able to do it'll, yeah it'll it'll be fine I always rebuild them I'm glad you're joining us Raimi welcome to the chat I say go all machine guns and sandpaper we probably will uh, at some point I'll probably have if I find good machine guns I'll probably do that so now let's look at our tanks, because we only have the two mechs. Let's look at let's look at our militia build. We're we're doing real Van Zant here, <laughs> starting poor. Um, do 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 the callus. That is a heavy. Oh boy, <laughs> it's got a heavy rifle and an SRM6. Oh boy. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> At least we've got armor cracking. We've got Sabo. That's nice. On here. For the first six shots. Estevez main battle tank. Oh my gosh. It, it just... It, this looks like it's probably primitive. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah it is. Machine guns. A heavy rifle. A flare mortar. It, this is basically a standard battle tank from today it's got grenade launchers <laughs> fuck uh what's the venonator what do we have here oh okay vtol with uh bombs cluster bombs and an ac10 hopefully that serves us well it's gonna get blown out of the sky we literally have a technical a rocket technical yeah, this is this is Van Zan, all right. This is this is Van Zan. Uh, Addy, we are. I, I am doing. Oh, good. Cut out. I mean, we did. Welcome to the chat, Panzer. Um, Addy, this is not the this is not the BTA uh, playthrough. This is Rob Cocaine and Rob playing Rogue Tech. So this is a fresh start. With rifles and rocket packs. <laughs> like, just all primitive. <laughs> Alright, well, we have a great death standard battle squad. That's cool. With light rifles and boarding claws. For the four units in that group. And we have the... Mine dispenser, laser, power armor, jump jets, boarding claws, and a specialist slot for what is F A? Fashi. Hmm. Okay. Well, <laughs> here we fucking go. <laughs> Yeah, it could be a Pinto with just hanging out. Yeah, this is gonna... It is perfect for a Van Zant start. If the enemy... I hope the enemy's just got aggri mechs. Like, fuck. <laughs> um, let's see here. 
Yeah, use that. I'm probably going to have the assassin carry battle uh, battle armor, to be honest. Uh, all of this sounds like something from Brigador. <laughs> Yeah, this is this has everything up to the 3062. I, I said a minute ago that I don't do jihad. I don't do anything past jihad when I play rogue tech because I just I feel like the tech uh, just gets a little bit like crazy, and I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of that. And I press the wrong button. I press the store button. My bad. Uh, cause all of these are gonna be too hard for us. Just looking at it, I'm like, nope, big nope. Um, we will get pooed on. So we're going to go to navigation. Yeah, battle armored assassin. The Argo may not be fully functional yet, but she's spaceworthy enough for our purposes. Let's see here. We're going to There we go. Lackland is almost entirely oceanic, apart from a few ar archipelagios, archipelagios. I think I'm saying it right. Ish. The local population finds life on this quiet planet idyllic, despite the chronic inability of any industry to turn a profit. Welp, it's not going to be idyllic for long. Let's go conquer it. Bye. Hopefully there's contracts. Archipelagus. Archipelagus. Wh whatever. That work order is complete, boss. <laughs> Do I like the four-legged elemental? Hey, boss, nice to see you. <laughs> no. Um, let's see here. Now we're going to do hull repair, because, you know, not having holes in the ship, probably a good idea. <laughs> I know it's very Van Zant to have holes in the ship, but uh, we're going we're gonna to prevent those holes for the moment. We're going to keep traveling. Arky parky duck abogla palagalog. Gonna just start barking it. But we we definitely are not gonna purchase the Solaris Seven license right now, because we are too far away to even bother using it. Alrighty. Looks like we've arrived, Commander. We are on station, and flashpoints are beginning to pro crop up. So that's. That's nice. Give me mission. It mission time. I also play with 66% larger maps because I apparently like hurting myself. Um, so yeah, that should be funny. <laughs> we will we will attempt this against uh, or who is this for? We're gonna fight for the pirates. Awesome. Uh, yeah, technology. We go in and get a... Um, local government forces. So we're going to fight some local government forces. For this pirate guy. Uh, we'll actually... We'll downgrade the salvage. Uh, well, it's not worth 34. I don't think we're even going to see this much salvage. In a lo low level recovery mission. Yeah, I like to give the mech's rune a stomp, and it makes things like artillery very useful. Um, whereas I don't feel like they are usually. Uh, well, let's see here. First things first, let's get the hunchback and the assassin on board. Um, let's get the Estevez, the Callus, uh, the Venonator. And the scimitar in. Let's stick Tex in our hunchback. And who do we have that is only a mech pilot? Um, Steepa in the assassin. And then uh, Vala can be in the Estevez. Strider in the Venator. Or the Venator. I keep saying Venator. It's Venator. Um, Corsair in the Callus and Slapdash in the Scimitar. Oh, oh my, okay. This used to be a little different. Last time I played this, it was in, it was Treadnought still. We're in Mech Rider. Um, hmm, I think we're going to remove the Scimitar then. And we're going to take a... 
we're going to take the Fashi uh, with uh, not oh. Slapjash. We're going to take it with Zombie uh, because Zombie belongs in Battle Armor. Sir Marcos, thank you for that follow. How kind of you. Sleep well, Zin. Thank you for coming out for a minute. And, yeah, we're going to Deproy. <laughs> Beerski, I love it. Yeah, hold your breath as you move between the bulkheads. I have the, like, enhanced speed on here, so there might be, like, me having to tone some options up and down as things load and as we play. No in tune town. See, we won't we won't have to like wear spacesuits to go from the cafeteria to the gym anymore. So we'll see how long it takes to gen this mission. I think I'll try to go to 11 Eastern, so a little less than two hours now that we're like in the game. Um, later on today, you you may have some text content. You might, no promises, but I believe he and Depp are scheduled for something today. Um, yeah, just between the shitter and the barracks. Get the spacesuit. Between the shitter and the barracks, you have to get a spacesuit on and then get it off in time while you're prairie dogging. <laughs> I do manual. Uh, I do manual drop locations as well. I kind of. I give myself a lot of control over where I drop, like what I'm dropping, in with uh, stuff like that. And of course, this is the first. This is the Weapons first map online. load. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Mm, bitch and Betty, I miss it. I love it. Begin mission. Command interface initiated. Target location is likely to be well defended. Move up. Get eyes on location. Neutralize enemy. Leopard will extract at LZ. Best of luck, derpy derp. Okay, let's do this. Deploy forbidden target zone. So one of the nice things is we can instead of deploying where it wanted us to, kind of over there, I can come around to this clear area. And how do I do this? There we go. So this is going to give us oop, 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 oop. the battle armor, the hunchback, the Estevez, the assassin, and the callus and all right here, right on this little kind of straight line. Like we have a little bit of cover here, we've got a little bit of a hill, some defilade, and we've got the woods to our left, but we can move through the left here. Um, and that's what I really like about manual deploy. See you, Beerski. Have a good one. I'm glad you came out to say hi. Thank you. You'll notice that different from BTA, everything has an individual initiative all the way out to like 20 or 30. Um, again, something I really like. Ready for orders. We have the AC-10 and two cluster bombs. And that is going to be it. We'll... Uh, Oh, this is our first mech anyway. Our first person. Uh, you'll notice that there's more like abilities and stuff. There's like, you can erratically maneuver to get battle armor off you. You can request hot drops of units. You can do careful maneuvers. So if you're in bad terrain, you do that. You can attack the ground like with the bombs. Um, it ends up all being very, a very nice kind of, uh, how do I say, representation of 
Battletech as a game. So we're going to quote unquote sprint the Venonator out to here. On my way. Double time. And we, we have targets. A Locust 3V and a Valkyrie Quick Cell. So the Quick Cell gear is pretty erratic. So we'll take uh, this. And does he still have... Well, no, he doesn't really have any movement or anything. Uh, no visual, so he's just a sensor blip. So we're at plus 13, but we still have a 20 to hit. So we'll, uh... We'll give it a go. We'll, we'll, we'll take a shot. It's a recoil of one, so it shouldn't be too bad. Um, if we were to fire at the Locust, let's see here. We'd actually have a better shot, but, uh... I'd rather be tagging this quick cell first. Because, like I said, their... Their, um... What's the word? Their armament, quick cell armament, is highly unpredictable. I copy. And we missed. Negative damage. Repeat. Well, good Negative thing you're just damage. the scout troop. So something's gonna go first. And literally... Light us up immediately. <laughs> awesome. Um... Paddock, well, thank you for that follow. Oh, I'm sorry, Norwegian. I hope you have a good one, and maybe you can check the VOD later. I hope uh, I hope your internet gets a little better. Yeah, and, it, like, and yep, miss. So they've run another Valkyrie that came up. I bet that's a quick sell as well. Let's see here. What's the range on this? gonna it's not gonna let me know is it because i can't see it uh, where's it minimum okay max 240 not super long it's a mortar but it's not that great uh we can mount let's see here how what's the jump range for this not good um we're gonna mount the assassin Full speed. There, Don't we run. have the Fashi on there. And that's going to be their turn, is to be aboard our, our armor. Yikes! That was some weird... It's not a PPC, but some weird, like, pseudo-quick-cell PPC. I don't think we really have a great sensor reading on them. Though. I'm on the clock. Let's what see. No, we can't even view them yet. Yeah, fired and yeah, missed. Pretty pretty much the story of uh, the start of these ones. Um, we'll run Texas care our pseudo Tex character up. Just the, we don't want to be in that like whatever mortar shit they have. I don't want to stay there. Um. Ooh, the LRM-10s, because of the Artemis, really good chances to hit. We're going to bring down the medium lasers, simply because I don't need him to overheat before he's in optimal firing range. An LBX PPC, that's why it's weird, okay. And limpent mines and grenade variety pack, those were the things that were probably fired at us. Hooray, quick sell. Let's see if I'm sober enough to hey, that, that tagged him up a bit. Definitely. We're going to have a lot of shit pants moments. And oh, look, we started a forest fire that he's standing in. That'll be helpful. He'll probably overheat really fast because he probably has quick cell heat sinks as well. Hey, stop it. Ready for orders. The assassin is now going to... We're actually going to jump the assassin just so we get like a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Jumping. Of uh, good distance covered with some good evasion, and so that we get the battle armor close. Um, I would like to hit this, but he—he's just not going to be able to. So we'll. 
do that. Not going to be able to hit him either. What are you good for? Jesus. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Yeah. All right. Well, whatever. Roger that. At least it'll hurt him because AOE. Standing by. This is our Corsair. So this is the Callus. It's just, it's a big rifle and uh, an SRM, and that is all that is aboard it. <laughs> we'll get right up on this rock. Let's see what we can do here. Nothing. <laughs> Very bad. We'll uh, we'll just we'll just be war crimes y about it, and we're gonna fire the armor piercing and the inferno. Be like, let's turn you on fire and turn you inside out. As stated, I have this very sped up. If you really want me to slow it down, I can. Um, but it keeps the game moving for something that takes so long to load sometimes. So I know you're not seeing like all the animations. That's why I kind of go and look back through and view everything. Uh, Lichter, what up? Good morning. Dude, your art has been amazing. I can't believe how awesome it is, Lichter. It's uh, it's pretty incredible. And everyone's having a really good time with it. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. The Estevez might be a shitty MBT from the past, but boy, howdy, does it have armor. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> um, unfortunately, it can't move for shit either. <laughs> We're just going to keep him on the right here then. Acknowledged. Let's see here. What can you do? Grenade launcher. Indirect fire. What's the flare round do? I don't remember. Probably should have looked into that. Uh, well, I mean, we're gonna... We're just going to lob flares at this guy and hope that we kind of blind him or something. So, pew pew! I don't know if that's going to do much. Might have helped give us the visual. Uh-oh. Ow! Still want to find the combat wombat? Hell yeah. Endless can of beans? Dude, the ta tank unicorn. <laughs> Ready to rock. Okay, so these guys are still mounted. Um, so we're going to dismount them now that they're close. And we're going to bring them off of here. We're going to jump them into range. We'll jump them in. We'll jump them into a, a blocked range. Oh, no. Move. Is this still obscured? Roger that, Commander. Let's get them right in here. So they can't mount up this turn, but if he doesn't move, he's going to be in for a bad time. And also, we have lasers. We're just going to shoot these lasers at him and be like, pew, pew! Because why not? Also, the fire spread, of course. Because that's what fire does in woods. <laughs> name of the, the name of the tank. Oh, Lictor, it's your afternoon. That's awesome. I'm glad you're off work and here to join us. Also, uh... <laughs> I left the evening stream up and got the morning one immediately. Nice, Flack. Welcome to the party. Uh, I, I have not been in a tank, and I'm glad I haven't, if that's the description. Let's see here. Missiles of ten unguided rockets uh, that dispense mines. We don't want mines in our own <laughs> AOE right now, so we're just going to pew-pew right here. I don't know that we hit him at all. Let's see here. Combat log. Uh, nope. 
<laughs> it does not seem we did. Good to go. All right, but we're going to use the momentum we've got here. Flames on the way it shouldn't really matter for uh, for a helicopter. A Gila Machopter. We are just going to attempt to lay into this man. Ammo, two. Bomb rack, two. AC, whatever. Go shoots. Yeah, I know. It's a little jank right there, but whatever. We definitely hit him a little bit. <laughs> Mom's chili from a week ago? What? It's just cooking. Ah, uh, he is a he is a very mobile unit who's trying to think, and it was that uh it was that locust who's like, I'm gonna take on the hunchback. Uh great job, Locust. Waiting for orders. So our callus is on fire, which uh, hopefully isn't a problem. On the move. We're gonna sw swap back to standards. We're just trying to get guns off the field. I know this thing has blown most of its weaponry, but it still has an energy weapon and it can still step on shit. So uh, APF SDS and standard missiles, Absolutely. go go. Well, we got a couple hits. There's his grenade launcher. Internal structure damage. I'm aware, Corsair. You'll be fine. Hopefully. Hella choppy copta. See you in a minute, Lictor. You walked up and punched. Now who's dumb for having all the? Oh no. You walked up and punched Tex in the face. That one hit me right in the feels. And then he no, fell on his butt. Blood. They actually hit me. Just square on his ass. You butthole. <laughs> can we, uh... Can we go punch mode on this guy? Is it V? Yeah, that's what it is. We can do the punch and then have an awful chance to hit. And the punch has an... Okay, that's probably not worth it then. We'll take a step back off of him. He's spicy anyway. We'll turn that off. And we'll, uh, we'll do our best to fire on a locust in the butt. Locked on for your armor. Reporting negative damage. You didn't lock on to shit. <laughs> you were locked Thank off. You. Well done. <laughs> oh, but this spider has opened itself up to some owie time, I believe. Um, yeah, he has... I don't know that they lose evasion in this one. I'm not. I don't remember quite how that rule works. Uh, just because I know it's different, but I know his his chance to hit was really shit. So I guess we'll lob flare at this guy. Hmm. Oh, he damn it! The spider is damaged at least. That's good. All weapons fire. Hey, I'll tell you what he doesn't like. Fucking. Got past the armor. Uh, he does not like getting wailed on with a main battle tank. I'm on the clock. What do you want? All right, Tex. Stand up. And paunch. Use these battle okay. fists. Second time's the chance. Well, no breaches on the armor yet. Just not, not feeling turbo great. Oh, I don't have the uh, vigilance yet. Poop. So what happened to this spider? Uh, it's right 
No, we blew off the left arm attacking from the front. So let's, uh... Let's see here. Flares have increased visibility in the area. We're going to move into the woods. And fire right. in the lasers. Let's get down to it. So we'll get some defense. We'll get some movement going. We're going to... There's no other armor, ammo in here. Might as well fire it. It's not like we don't carry an ass load of it. One of three for consciousness. And is suffering a pilot skill penalty. And we, we cannot make ourselves the less owie, I don't believe. First aid, yeah. Well, maybe next turn. Let's see here. Hey, Data Smith. One attitude adjustment coming right up. Yeah, he didn't like that. He didn't like that at all. Well, you look. fall down now. <laughs> Is there really any helping, Ralphie Foxy? <laughs> Uh, we're just gonna keep hopping our battle armor around. Our zombie battle armor like a mad person. Burned an illuminated forest. We could jump into there and see what happens. Um, actually, I'm gonna keep hopping him towards this guy, the Valkyrie. And we're gonna lay down every mind dispenser now at that thing. It's like, go, our little minions. Re-at him. Re-at him well. Doot, doot, doot. Hope you like mines, bro. Here we go. Because now you have a lot of them. No love on that track. Oh, no, there's lots of love over there. Don't worry about it. He lob a grenade launcher? <laughs> a helicopter? Alright, did he get damaged? Oh yeah, he did not enjoy walking through that minefield. Commander? Which is good. And now our, our helicopter's like, hey! Hey, fuck you! You ass! We're just actually, we're just going to fly it out over here. Position and we're just going to use the AC because we don't want to blow up our own battle armor. Firing. And of course we missed because, you know, that's the game. <laughs> oh no, he's he's got a mine way all right. He walked through it. Now he has very little left in his legs. That locust is just running, just like, re, don't hurt me. <laughs> oh, and it might be time to just make this spider disappear. Or can we get a good shot on this guy? Not from that close. If we move back, it's not so bad. We're gonna we're gonna take the kill shot, hopefully, on the spider here. Cause uh gun's off. Just get get guns off the field. Now, the order that this fire is in is the armor-piercing round first, so we'll get the extra armor damage, and then we'll get the crit, crit seeks with the SRM. We're going to go for the leg, just because, hey, it might be nice if this thing cracks and we get, you know, more of it to salvage. I'm thinking he might eject soon, question mark? Because there's not a lot of him left. That Valkyrie, so they're basically, they, they use quick sell units, they're basically out of everything. Um, this guy's out of arms, <laughs> and, and dying quickly. I'm on the clock. So we're going to have want? Tex step into this guy's rear arc. 
Um, let's see here. If we sprint at it, we can get the lasers in range. Let's make some bad decisions. And we can just speed. We can blast away. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yeah, that's not surprising <laughs> in that game, Foxy. Uh, we're even going to fire the Artemis because why not? We have it. We have the ammo. We have the technology. And we have his rear. So we're just going to unload with the Alpha. And we got a lot of... Well, we needed salvage anyways. We got a lot of strikes with that, with the lasers. Um, opened him up. Damaged his energy weapon. He's basically fists now. Commander. Uh, the Assassin... So this Locust is just totally overheated. Um, so let's see here. How go punchy time now? Let's see. V. Punchy time's still not good. If we hit him, we would damage his stability, which would remove his evasion. So in Rogue Tech, you don't just lose evasion pips. Um, for things like that. In fact, you, you'll you probably notice that like you see one evasion pip here. It's, it's kind of awkward how evasion pips work. We can't even tell how many he has. So we're just going to uh, move back again. Right to here. We'll attempt this. Should I hot load these? No, it doesn't really improve anything. I'll just blow up the weapon. We'll just keep harassing him. Let's see how you like this. So we blew up our... We, we didn't blow up, but we hit ourselves a little bit. But more importantly, we get a little bit of crit seeking on him. Didn't do anything, but we did open him up. So we, we tagged him aye a little. Aye. Da, 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 da. This one jammed. Can we get around to there? No. But we could still move up and shoot this man in the mouth. I'm going to turn off the grenade launchers. We don't need to re-illuminate the area. We're going to use that, of course. And we are just going to switch to standard rounds. We're just going to try to blow off another torso. He destroyed like seven at the low, low cost of the rest of the lance. Yeah, feel you got to hurt their morale too, right? Um, So it's going really fast. A... Yes, I did upgrade my computer very recently, like within the past week. And B, I have it set to like 175% uh, speed, so that it actually moves quickly. <laughs> so like, the, you, this guy's dying, you'll see it... Yeah, he, 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 he ejected, he was like, fuck that noise. Um, you'll see things after they happen, basically. Let's see here, are we in range? Oh, we, we are. We are. 68%. Confirm. Copy that, Commander. I got you. Oh, you are mounted! <laughs> Rip and tear. So when you mount like that, if you, if you get the mount, which we got the mount, we are aboard this Valkyrie, and he is not happy, because we have lasered him. Wasser Hunden! Thank you very much. Subbing with Prime. Appreciate it. Uh, Flat, give me one second. Um, so we did the lasers on him and the boarding claws. Both go off. And he is in big ouch trouble now. As you can hopefully see here. Yeah, we ripped an entire torso out and he has no weapons. So all he can do is roll on the ground, swat with his remaining arm, or basically shake like a dog. I'm ready for orders. Uh, which is funny. Um, I upgraded, so I had 16 gig RAM memory, and now I put in two 16 gig chips, so, and I kept my eights, so I've got 48 gigs of memory, um, I put a 3060 Ti in from a 980, I moved this game onto an M.2 2 terabyte SSD, and I upgraded my monitor, which doesn't really affect any of this, but I'm running my first 1440 Hi, monitor. We're a little too close to use the cluster without bombing our assassin a bit, so I'm not going to do that. But we're going to hope that this AC-10 lands good and hard. Okay. Derpshire! Baron of Derpshire, thank you for that follow. Send him to Mickey D's in the sky. Rear armor. 
Not not today, not with this pilot. Uh, 3060 Ti. Um, and no, I don't, I don't have money anymore, that's for damn sure. Uh, it all went away. <laughs> uh, doing that. I'd been waiting, I'd been, like, saving up for years to try to do that, to be honest. Um. I had, not I had not upgraded in a very long time. If we remain stationary, does this function? Maybe. <laughs> you slammed in harder than an orbital atlas? Well, I'm glad you did. Thank you for coming. Um, let's see here. Where's that? There, we're going to reserve Steepa right now. Because I don't want to move him until I see what this locust is going to do. Uh, it's the four flag. Uh, what? Hang on. <laughs> Sorry, this is going to zoom in and out because I'm trying to figure out what just happened. Mech was on fire. Plus 15 from fire. Apply heat sinks. Explosion check. Ha! <laughs> His MG ammo went up. And he exploded. Oh. I'm, I am a TTRPG D&D-esque fan in this crowd. That is me. Oh, yeah. If you, if you have new hardware, it's hard to upgrade from that right now. I, I can definitely see that. So we're not going to shoot our own armor, by the way, because we don't want to do that. That sounds like a bad idea. So we're not going to shoot that Valkyrie. Instead, we're going to move to a... Let's see here. Can we get a clear line and... Yep, there it is. We're going to move at optimum range for the LRM-5 with the Swarm. Crit seek a little bit, uh, if we can, with the LRMs, because he's kind of sandpapered. He's got armor. But we're going to hope that we can get a tag into here on him. Crack the armor and then let the swarm do its job. Doesn't seem like it happened. But uh, he's hurting pretty bad anyway. The infinite can of beans, rare artifacts, stat blurb. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's my turn. I'm like, is it is it still thinking? It was not. It was not still thinking. It was just waiting for me. Let's see here. Oh, you are you are about to be the ouch. I'm wounded, Commander. Wounded from what? What'd you do? I don't even... What did he do? What happened? Oh, they went and we had a unit destroyed. Uh, because he he did the, uh, the whole SWAT thing. That was probably what that was catching up to. He did a get battle armor off me command and it worked. Roger. And that was a giant battle tank cannon opening his ass up. Oh, okay, Flack. That, that sucks, to be honest. What do you want? But upgrading anything right now is, is shitty. I, I get that. I get that too. Wow. So this is what happened. Ouchie. Um, oof. Yeah, these guys got hurt. Are they still aboard this Valkyrie? No, they are not. So he was able to get them off by doing something drastic. Uh, they might have landed in a mine. That might have not helped. But whatever, that's what zombies is for. 
Uh, <laughs> that's what the zombie is for, being battle armor. Uh, let's see here. You wanna you wanna square up? Okay. You, you wanna step into the squared circle? Oh yeah. Adjustment coming right up. Guess what? Alpha strikes all day. Standing by. That thing's got them double heat sinks, and they are doing their job. We'll go at flank speed just to try to get a good shot on here. Eh. Step right up. Copy that. We'll turn on another flare grenade. This is still jammed. This is still shooting. Aw, oh, dude, I'm playing Genesis... Or I played, recently played, right before the one I was playing right now, was uh, Genesis Mass Effect. It's a really good system. Attacking from position. I, think ah, I can see why people enjoy this line of work. We're just gonna step behind into position. him, and we're gonna fire another AC-10 round. Taking a shot. Hey, something just blew up on you. Salad connection up. Yeah, he uh, he did not like that, and he went bye bye. <laughs> Zombie not having the best time. Let's see here. Let's try to I'm on the clock. give what him uh, a little bit of health back or something. All right. I'm not quite sure Let's how that works. It's part of why I wanted to use it. I'm like, huh. Turn off the medium lasers. Get ourselves cooled off. Cause he, I don't think he's going to make it through the next two waves or salvos. Let's see if I'm sober enough to line this up. You lost one of ours. Oops. Well, who needed salvage anyway? Well, Tex decided that he would aim in the sky and shot our helicopter. Um, that happened. I hope that comes back. <laughs> Oops! Yikes! <laughs> yeah, that was a that was a big. Yeah, that's that's pretty crazy. Um, that's the game. <laughs> but we'll knock him over by critical hit, commander. Ripping a leg off, and he's just gonna eject. Yes, Commander. And then we're uh, we're gonna avoid the fire because that seems like something that smart people would do. And we'll just brace. I'm here. Vala, we'll send you forth. Let's move. You know what we won't send forth? That freaking yeah. chopper. It's not there anymore. <laughs> we'll get you away from the mines and stuff, buddy. Copy that. So with the new battle armor sprites, it's like this is one, this is one guy, and he doesn't have any mines left, but that's one piece of battle armor. Then there's this piece uh, is damaged, like this unit, this unit's damaged, this unit got blowed the fuck up. We'll just uh, we'll just put him in here. All right, let's get down to it. Let's see here. Aye, aye. Not a good unit to Waiting be moving. Let's see. We can run him up through here and the fire will hopefully stop soon. And then we'll jump the assassin way, way, way over here. If there's anything else, we'd see it. Brace. Good to go. Alright, can you just like move out of the fire? Affirmative. Fire, right. no fire. Let's get down ing. to it. Roger. Got it. Venting heat. I'm just gonna let them all vent because we just need to get into the zone. Standing by. 
and uh, we're not going to get lazy. We're just going to jump again because we don't want to step on our own minefield. Not the hardest match. Um, so we'll just brace, 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 brace. There we go. Let's see what happened to that lady in the helicopter, eh? <laughs> Just like comes back and is like, you shot me. I was in the sky. You have Artemis. Puffs on cigar. Shit happens. <laughs> it's not you not knowing deep lore. I don't think it's intentional. It's just funny. So we spent some ammo. We have ammo and drop costs that were done. Oh no, lost lost reputation with a p one planet's government. Forsooth and shame. And then the heat sink upkeep keep for our coolant and everything. So we got 106. Uh, <laughs> let's, uh, let's see. Hey, we were able to put it back together. All right. And Unit 3 got exploded. But uh, I, we'll see how that works. Because I'm not sure how the repairing power armor works in this one. And everything else is doing okay. Yeah, I guess he does. I didn't play a lot of that game, but uh, I can see it. <laughs> Grenade variety pack. These quick sell weapons are fucking hilarious. An entire gift basket of different grenades. The LRM-20 quick sell. Minus three accuracy. Jesus. Oh, this will be nice. Negates no visual and provides plus one ranged accuracy. That is going on the fucking hunchback. That is for damn sure. These are probably quick sell actuators. This is one of my favorite parts. So like if you're if you're here for this game, like for Rogue Tech, you're going to see me sitting and doing a lot of mech building. Just be forewarned. This is one of my favorite things to do with this. We actually this is incredible getting getting endo steel off the bat is a big fucking deal. Death from above. I don't know what that means. What do I do? Does that mean I have to? <laughs> oh we're gonna take the pulse laser for sure because we're we're getting quite a bit of salvage still four and 17 so we'll probably get a lot of these parts anyway but there's things i want to make sure i'm getting <laughs> yes honor the red well can the battle armor attaching to things count as a dfa because they jump on and like really really try to murder things gain some tonnage back <laughs> hey you want to take you want to take heat sinks out of your mech here oh my god oh those are fucking doubles never mind or that that's the quick sell ones oof uh quick sell quick sell quick peel and stick armor <laughs> fuck quick sell quick sell quick sell so i think the most valuable thing here is probably a double heat sink kit i know a light engine's really nice i know pharaoh's really nice uh two two point five million heat sink kit in the first mission is nuts huge deal huge deal I mean, I can I can use the assassin for that. We'll have to try. It's got jumpies. So we got part of that locust. We got two parts of the nice spider. We got part of the... We're going to sell this right away. I don't even want to pay for the cargo on that. Uh, an extra battle fist is always nice. Um, we got the light engine as well. We're, gonna, we're just going to sell the quick sell stuff because oof. And we'll probably sell that standard fusion arm engine. Um, and we'll put in a couple upgrades now, because now we can already do upgrades. Like, hell yeah. (laughs) 
See you in a minute, Lifter. You'll count it if the battle armor DFAs? Okay. Endo Steel is just like advanced structural material. It is the same quality but lighter um, than regular battle mech structure. Don't try to think about it scientifically. It's it's future fictional space magic. Yeah. It makes your it makes the raw chassis, the raw naked chassis lighter. Oof. Fifty three thousand in ten days for repairs. Oh, make it so. We'll see what happens with all that. Um La Mech Bay. Ooh, stop it. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah, it's Gundanium, exactly. It's what it needs to be, for lack of a better word. It's just like whatever it needs to be. Alright, let's see here. Well, this thing already runs cool, so we don't need to bother with that. But, we can, on here... Give this thing punch attack damage, punch attack stability. Um, we can stick the battle fist in. And I know, we're over tonnage now. Uh, well, now we're not. Um, we're actually right at the, the correct tonnage. Um, how much does this weigh? We can get a little bit of extra armor on here too. Um, I suppose we'll just stick a couple points into the torsos we'll take five points off the face stick that there we'll just do 66 like that yeah it's it's the chassis We don't really need to upgrade from basic to basic. That doesn't doesn't matter. Standard fusion engines, blah blah blah. We do not need a quick soil, quick cell recoil thing. I don't really know. Oh, because it's huge. That's why. Yeah, I'm having fun. Thank you, Bowser. I I am the the biggest of Mech Warrior sleuths. You're not wrong. You're just an asshole. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, well, we really don't have a lot else to put on here that I would want on here yet. The battle fist and a little extra armor will will put a little oomph into this, um, which is nice. Good morning, Bowser. On it. I'll let you know <laughs> Why does it state oops as the cause? Yes. Uh, let's see here. Alright, so we got to wait a few days for everyone to be like, you know, alright again. Strider, who fucking apparently bailed out just in time, as Artemis missiles from a hunchback came flying at her face. I mean, it is true. It was an open time, and I was just like, hey, this would be fun. Alright, it is time to see what happened with that battle armor now. Hey, like, Commander. like what happens when it gets... When you lose units and stuff from battle armor, I, I want to see in the battle armor bay... What What's missing now? Magistry of Canopus battle... <laughs> Fuck. All right, so the, each one of these is a unit. Okay. So he really does lose, like, all that shit. Okay. Repair all. So the mind descent suspenser, the boarding claws, and the power armor gents, ju uh, jump jets can be fixed. Let's see here. Battle armor, battle armor, stealth, battle armor, battle armor, battle armor, blah, 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 blah. So we can't really do any of that. We're going to need to buy a new weapon because the battle armor laser got blowed up. So we will we will go and see if they have any battle armor weapons and be like, y'all got some of them guns? The, 
the cheeky. Yeah, there's all kind. There's all kinds of ridiculous, stupid lore in BattleTech. I just, I just hand wave things, and I'm like, ah, I need. I have shit to blow up. <laughs> like, I don't care. Fuck it. Battle armor. Oh, it's a one-shot battle armor SRM2. That's not the best gun. <laughs> uh, we could probably do better. Oh, this is nice. You can add integral heat sinks with this. Five tons of heat sinks. If we needed critical slots, this would be good. Um, I think we'll buy both of these. We'll buy one there. And we'll buy a five just in case. Um, high explosive bombs are always fun if we had anything to put them on. I don't think there's a bad armor weapon besides this one. Alrighty then. New weapon systems. A whoopsie doodle. <laughs> uh, mech bay. So let's go. Let's go re-equip this trooper. He's just like, can I has gun please? Got him. Let's see here. Yeah, we'll just stick that in there. Oh, you can upgrade the, uh, I guess the laser was heavier. You can upgrade the armor on each unit. So each trooper gets his own little armor value. How cute. 38, 38, 38. And of course it falls right in that spot of not being able to be even. Because why would it? The Fa Shi FS1. Shouldn't be too hard. Let's look at the vehicle bays. Everything here is running. Let's look at the mechs. They're still in ouch mode. Uh, da, 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 da. Scrap four C bills. Yeah, because fuck that noise. And if I come to the point where I'm using this locust, I would rather die. Because it is worth nothing. Because it is locust. And locust equals poop. Fight me. I don't like locusts. <laughs> like, if you do. Cool. You are you are a better man than I, because <laughs> I cannot use those things. Can't stand them. Mm, let's see here. We'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of the peel and sticky. We'll keep these in case we get a primitive mech that can use them, and we'll actually keep the quick cell upper. So when you see minus, minus is actually good for like recoil and accuracy. Like you want. You want to reduce your penalties, so doing the minus on recoil is good. We'll sell this fusion engine, though. When you find primitive mechs, these are actually useful, because then you can upgrade them to be, like, contemporary. Mm Take off your shoes. Okay. Make yourself comfortable. We're not going to do an assassination yet, because that'll probably get us killed. We'll do a flat battle. Rampaging in Davian territory in Lachlan. They've been raising population centers. Blah, 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 blah. We need to find them and destroy them. Cool. We'll do that. We'll do that real good. Yeah, I mean, if you can set it up like that, that's definitely a good way to do it. Uh, the locust with the mortar. Um, I think we'll take 4 of 17, because it says max, like a lance. So we should have to fight a full group. Oh, that's when he realized he has to advance time, because this isn't Mech Warrior 5. Whoopsie doodle. I should also do a game save. Van Zant, uh, for stream. There. You guys get your own little save file. Look at that. Hopefully the game's not chugging along too badly. I like to think that I've optimized this well enough. The 
those upgrades you asked for where it's not too slow it's not going too slowly um because i know this game this rogue tech specifically and bta as well as foxy will probably tell you on his stream they're just hard to run they're just really hard to run sometimes uh, yeah, da, da, da. let's see here We'll, uh, we'll get the improved conduits next. Roger that, I like to shore up the ship because it gets rid of a lot of the events in the game. Like the, the random events. That can really fuck you over. There we go. Ready to go over we'll pay the bills. And again, this is, why, this is also why I like starting with a little bit of extra cash. Yeah, Foxy's PC is not like this. Uh, it's a 6700 processor. So it's a little bit of an older processor, but... These guys are injured, that's fine. Alright, back to the command center. Greetings, Commander. Come on in. Uh, yeah, I, I've, I've pumped this computer into beefy territory like that. I'm, I'm definitely aware of that. In a way that not a lot of people probably get to. Hmm. Okay, well it changed the financial thing made it change the mission, so that's fine. Capture base hard, destroy base hard. Operation Green Mech. Tortugan Propagandist, eh? <sighs> this is going to be tough, but I don't really have a lot of choices if I want to get paid before uh, shit changes. So we're going to take on what is probably going to be a reinforced assassination chart target. Yeah, they they even if you've never looked, they recommend that you play this with like I don't I don't even remember. It's like, hey, you're supposed to have oh, how much? Like 16 gigs RAM minimum. And they recommend uh 32. All right. Well, we'll put glitch in there. And we will put slapdash in for text. Uh, you missed us winning and also shooting down our own helicopter, but that's all right. Cause we put it back together. <laughs> So we'll be in the Highlands again. We're, we're taking on... I know it's like a one skull or a half skull mission. Assassinations are difficult. They always are in Rogue Tech. Because they come with like... They're going to come with a lance. And they're going to come with the target. And they might come with a reinforcement. And well these are going to be pirates. So we'll see if they have pirate weaponry that breaks. Or pirate weaponry that hurts real bad. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I put this on the M.2. This that's, this game is why I bought a 2 terabyte M.2. I, I'm i literally, I'm giving Plasma to pay off the, uh, the cost of the upgrades for this. Oh, I intend to unalive them. Don't you worry, Rikar. Don't you worry. Dude, the Pirate Rack AC-20, that is probably a thing. I know that for sure a thing is, like, the silver bullet, like... Th there was a variant of the Panther that's been in this forever, and it's, like, it's literally Ash from Evil Dead. It has, like, this weird silver bullet, like, sawn-off LBX cannon instead of the, uh, instead of the PPC. 
and it's like Satan's 666 Panther, and it has a chainsaw. <laughs> but yeah, for real, to pay for these upgrades, I'm donating plasma like every week. <laughs> Command interface initiated. For a while, probably. I don't know why it actually stopped. It's not like I fucking need it. Alright, we're gonna not deploy in the bottom of a valley. Where's our map edge? So the maps are big, like I said before. I made the maps really, really big. We can also deploy basically on top of them if they're traveling through this road because you get certain amounts of space. Um, but I don't know if I want to deploy all my units on high ground like that. Let's see here. Uh, na, 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 na. Hmm. It might be the best spot, though. Because I can't get around to there. And that's a really awful attempt to climb if we go there. I think I might try to do it in the middle, like back here. So I can send some units this way, and I can send some units down. Or maybe I should do this. Let's see what I can get away with. Oh, oh my. Okay, come on, cooperate. So what, what just placed? I must know. That's the hunchback. Is not what I want there. So let's uh, let's put him here and the assassin up there. And then how far is it going to let me go? It's not going to let me go that far. Okay. Well, we're going to do that, and uh, we'll see if we can't take these units. We'll actually just do this. We'll put everybody there, and we'll see if we can't swing our vehicles down, and they'll join the fight late. And uh, we'll put the power armor on the assassin again. Yeah, there's a Clint variant with an Eastwood, and it's it's basically it's got like a 44 Magnum for a hand. Okay. Oh, sometimes it highlights that even though it's not that unit's turn. Supporting enemy forces, there they are. Yep, Vulcan pirate commando. Can't tell if that's a pirate Vulcan because covered. Yeah, BL, don't know what that is. Looks horrible. More like bullshit, I guess. On my way. Double time. Wow. We're not hitting that. <laughs> let's uh let's just wait. Good to go. Grey Death Standard just has these battle these light rifles. Uh but we gotta mount up onto something oh can we not mount up Wolfe, thank you for that follow much appreciated I guess we can't mount up these guys are just gonna be fucking trucking it Maybe, maybe we'll be able to figure it out later. Let's run them forward then. So these guys are going to move. I don't know what that commando just did. I don't, yeah, I don't know what he did. I think he just braced. Ready for orders. Again, I have this sped up so much that sometimes I lose what they're actually, the enemies are trying to do. Um, one thing I do like to make use of is the shift click button. So like this guy, if I want him to have maximum movement, I would have to move him out here, right? Like three. What I can do is I can set the sprint or I'd have to be like, oh, run all the way out to here. And you'll get a three. What I can do is I can shift click, uh, not on sprint, but on a move maneuver. And I can say, okay, move here, and then move here, so that I end my turn next to my battle armor. And still can get... Oh, calculating. There we go. 
and can be next to them and still get kind of my maximum movement. Uh, yeah, we're going to fire the swarms in there, of course, because that's what they're good for. What's this last one? That's a com this is a real commando. So they've got a couple commandos and a Vulcan that's got crazy shit on it. I don't know how he got six evasion from... Oh, this was the one that moved. Derp. Okay. My bad. Yeah, thank you for that follow, of course. I th oh, I already said that. Whoopsie. Gorilla-like posture. There, I'm pretty sure that exists. Confirmed. I can't wait to fire some Inferno missiles in here and be like, Ha! Walk through that! <laughs> I have a feeling they probably have four units plus this, so I'm facing about five enemies. But they might they might only have four, if that's a uh, three-piece. Good to go. Better than it could have been, that's for sure. I really wanted to move these guys down toward this road, but now I don't think that is a, an optimal thing to do. Roger. I'm just going to move the battle tank up on here. Uh, forget that. Forget all of that. Uh, let's see here. Where, where be the button to do the thing I must do? There it is. Shoot that motherfucking ground. Wait a minute. Oh, they won't go that far. Well, poop. Will they go this far? This is the, the guessing game of Rogue Tech. Can we... Can we make fire, please? Zorg must be praised. Ah, forget it. We'll save that for a later date. Yeah, they do have quad mechs now. I'm not playing with them, probably. Like, you probably won't see them. Yeah. Well, welcome. I'm glad you're popping in, Z-Wolf. Uh, welcome to the party. We are The rest of the Legion resides here. <laughs> And yeah, glad to have you, man. There'll be some good programming all lined up today. Um, I'm just starting the day off for everybody a little bit. Hey, those LRMs are going to land on him pretty well. Target confirmed. Yeah, got a fucking few hits. Good, good, fair few hits. I don't think they have sensors or anything on us yet, which is definitely in our favor right now. Let's see here. Yeah, if we move up into the woods, let's move. We'll uh, we'll hit them with flare launcher and AP FSDS. Yeah, and now we have a better shot on that Vulcan. He's finally hittable because he's moved. Confirmed. Ooh, slapped him good. Take that butthole. Right in your fucking chest. Uh, Commander? Awesome. I'm glad that you have your O2 bottles. Um, you may, you may be diving into the VOD because I'm not going to be able to be online for much longer. Um, but I'm glad you're able to start it out. Uh, I used to actually watch when Battletech first launched. Um, I would watch people play vanilla Battletech for hours while I was at work. You know, I'd be sitting there. And I would just have a stream up myself um, while I was entering data and stuff. Trooper Farmer, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. We're going to cluster bomb these guys. Um, it should be hilarious and awesome. Two salvos of 90 meter AoE. They're standing right next to each other. 40 AoE damage to the unit, so we're just going to sandpaper them um, with about 48 damage. So if it hits, it'll do 8, I should say. Uh, and then the AoE is another 40. Firing. So he takes an AC-10, and then they both take 40 damage. So he is having a bad time, because he just took another one to the fucking chest. Waiting for Hold this in your chest. 
We're going to see if we can mount up on the assassin now, because that would be really nice. Huh. Oh, did I select the wrong thing? Apparently, this particular type of battle armor cannot mount our own units. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Yeah, this, uh, they cannot do. I guess we, uh, we're just gonna keep running forward like crazy people and be like, uh, four Van Zandt with our rifles and, uh, and shoot them if we ever make it close enough. But that's that. Yeah, that's the D. Hey, stop it. Your SRMs and shit. I think we got very lightly tagged in the side. So this guy's a little sandpapery. This guy's hurt. Uh, well, they had plenty of bullshit to launch. Hopefully those are one-shot rocket packs. Standing by. No, 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 no. Well, uh, you know what? We're not going to have our uh, Hunchback fire right through the ass of the uh, Venator for a second time. So instead, we're going to move a little bit to the left first. And uh, hopefully not have a rocket go into the butt of our battle armor. <laughs> uh, that would be an awkward miss. But uh, stranger things have happened in the game of Rogue Tech. Uh, the Vulcan's trying to run away. And that is against the Van Zant rules of engagement. Firing at enemy six. So we're just going to open your back up with Artemis 4 missiles. Because the Hunchback is the only proper thing we have on the field. There already is a Silverback. <laughs> in in, in Battletech, that's already a mech, I believe. I'm like 99% positive. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's get this guy in here. We're actually going to sprint instead of jump. Um, just because I don't want to take the accuracy penalty when I can keep slamming this guy in the butt. Well, I just said that. And can't take it back. Let's see how you like this. Hey, we got a 10 there. That's probably an SRM hit. Waiting for orders. Uh, the Callus is going to move in now and hopefully run a shot right into this guy from that heavy rifle. Heavy rifle is primitive as shit, but I mean, damage is damage. 60 damage is 60 damage. That's a lot. That's a lot of damage. Uh, and I'm not going to make it the armor piercing on this one. Um, oh boy. Rough shots, because he is way out there. But who knows? We might, we might miss and hit something else, and hopefully it's not our fucking chopper. Let's see. Got the angle, taking the no, shot. we didn't hit anything, which, yeah. honestly, not the worst outcome we've learned. Yeah? Uh, yeah? Yes? Commander? Confirmed. Uh, yeah, we're going to launch flare rounds out there again uh, for peeking at the enemy. We're going to switch to standard. And we're just going to... Here we go. Damn it. No, you, you didn't need to hit for the flare rounds to do their job, lady. It's okay. Waiting for orders. Alright, we're gonna get... Location confirmed. Ooh, what was that? Oh, they have Intersphere Standard Battle Armor. So we might end up having Battle Armor Punchy time. And, uh, it... I guess I can see the enemy Locust now? Can't tell what variant or anything, but that is the assassination target. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's those are some good numbers. He had SRM fours that he couldn't bring to bear. Machine guns, uh, likely a medium laser. This thing would have hurt. I usually think Vulcans are lame, but uh. I guess this one's not. 
Compliment on enemy. Well, he is now. I mean. Did you stand Target inside your fire. own bomb radio? Never mind. Just never Receiving mind. You. <laughs> I can't say I'm surprised. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna approach this commando from the side, because I want to give myself clear firing lines with my other Roger. troops. Confirm. Hey, caught him with some of it. Give him a nice crack. He's going to shoot it here. We're going to hope that four is enough to dodge because they're dumb pirates and they're probably drunk. This guy's not going to get anywhere close to us yet. Ow! Hey, I told you you were drunk. Stop it. I hear ya. Make me a lar. Yeah, still can't mount up. It's just funny to me. It's like, all right. New new mechanics. Mounting mechs with your with your guys, with your battle armor. If we had a tank with a crew bay, they could mount a crew bay. So that is just an FYI. Let's turn these on for the sake of it. I guess he's just like perimeter defense now. <laughs> I sleep on the Vulcan because I don't like it in Mech Warrior 5. I'm I'm aware that that's foolish, but did he hurt himself moving? I think he hurt himself moving. The Ripper. Well, he uh, didn't do himself any favors, once again. Ah, we can't. We can go around this rock. Hey, there it is. Come out of the woods and we'll get in a better Let's shot. Uh-huh. And we're going to switch back to APFSDS. Firing. And we miss. Reporting negative damage. I pr if I got a Vulcan, I'd happily take one right now. I mean, I have two battle mechs, period. The Van Zant militia don't turn down free, know what I'm saying? Excuse me, burp. Yep. Vala, just keep moving in. Keep moving in and don't stand behind the death squad. <laughs> Acknowledge. Looks like a fucking Abrams. <laughs> Alright, don't shoot in the air. Rule number one, okay? Do not shoot in the air. Got it, Vala? Good. Better than Target hitting the chopper. Janky. Commander. I'm scared. I'm literally scared. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. all right. <laughs> Roger. Did we shoot ourselves? Ah, he has overheating units, I believe. That's why I keep hearing that blip. All right, let's, uh, Let's just use our our mighty aerospaciness to fly over yonder. Let's move. And be like, hello! And just start harassing this guy. Because even even shooting at them kind of fucks Wait, with their morale. You, like you can you can get them to eject sometimes without even hitting them. If they've already uh -huh. lost units. We'll cover the back of the assassin with them. We'll just keep advancing on him, since they're both about to go. He'll probably move to the rear, I think. But uh, I'm really hoping the choppers just got the chops to, like, dodge it. Oh, ow. Whatever that was, uh, AoE rocket. Minor damage. Not a big deal. I don't even think it made it to the battle armor, so 90 meter AoE. Okay, you need to stop being good with those. I'm in trouble. You're not in trouble. You haven't, you know, fallen out. Look, the most trouble you've been in is with your own units. Although not great that the AC-10 is damaged. Yes, Commander. All right, these guys, they are downhill now, which is not where I wanted him to make it. Like in that little alcove, because now he's really hard to shoot. Ooh. Ooh, but that could be good. 
fire down upon him with Infernos. So hopefully, this at least starts redlining him. And he's got a lot of ammo on there to blow up. Got it. Hey, some of that hit. Some of that hit. And we started a couple fires. Always nice. Standing by. He just moved the battle armor, not a big deal. So you, your left side's damaged and we're not gonna be able to make it to it feasibly. So we'll uh we'll hippity hoppity get off my brand new property because this is mine now. Um we'll take an unobstructed shot here. We don't have anything other than those swarms, whatever. Crit seeking. Giving him everything I've got. Just hoping that one of those one of those ones can always get a crit. Ready for orders. Just a little bit of that AoE. That's all it takes. Again, we'll hope that we don't shoot ourselves. This is a lot more likely to shoot self. We're gonna turn off the lasers. We're gonna leave these in indirect. Engaging with target. Well, they didn't go indirect, but uh, it's, it appears we didn't shoot ourselves that hard. <laughs> no, those were—I think yeah. that was from the AOE again uh, that they had launched. Because um, if it hadn't been, those Artemis would have done more damage than four. Understood. Moving fast. Yeah, we're just gonna keep lighting them up, I guess. Hey, one of those actually t like landed on him. Cool. right side okay we'll pull her back to like here Move order received. yeah this thing's damaged uh, where's the weapon damage plus two that's what's hurting right now didn't hurt enough though a critical hit. you don't have an arm anymore congratulations I hear ya <gasps> ooh Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, we're not going to shoot past our assassin, but we are going to shoot. It's not going to go well. But pew, pew. Got it. Hey, somebody struck. And we didn't hit ourselves. Order. That's like a good day. That's a really good day, Tater. Alright, let's see here. So, to get a good shot on him. Wow. Okay, we're just going to reserve and see where he goes. With Steepa. I see we're having a discussion on <laughs> things in chat. Excellent. Ready for orders. No, reserve again. Hold. So they should all be freaking out and he hasn't even moved, I don't think. Or if he has, he's not getting very close. Oh no, you shot my assassin that has plenty of armor currently compared to you. Their inner sphere standard took a little walkie. I'm gonna have to turn off the movement animations. Those are kind of annoying. Minimal damage Mess with some hit. of that in between. Good to go. Mm -hmm. do, do, do. Let's just get him. Actually. Fuck that noise, don't even move. Waiting for orders. This ends up being a really nice shot if you don't go anywhere. I copy. Good I don't think he hit with the cannon, but hell, that the uh, three or four missiles hit. What's he moving now? Oh, that's the locust in the corner. I'll deal with you later. Orders. Oh, that's kind of nice. All right, but move closer. We move. I copy. Let's move to here. And we're going to uh, use lasers this time. Direct fire on him. Pew pew. Aye aye. Hey, we caught that uh, open area with one of them. 
What, what did we damage? I don't know, but he's about to lose that torso. Commander. Especially if I walk up to here. Actually. Can punch, maybe? Maybe? Can punch? Oh, wait. Somebody demanded a DFA. God damn it. Yeah, somebody redeemed it to me. God damn it. Alright. This is gonna hurt. <sighs> you bastards. Affirmative. No luck. I'm going to tell you what didn't happen. We didn't hit him. <laughs> uh, we didn't hurt ourselves too badly either. Yep. Although we are a little... We're a little unsteady. We just tried to jump on someone's face. But whatever. Alright, we'll just keep climbing in the range here. Let's use a regular maneuver so we get some... Uh, Try to keep some of that. Um, we're not going to fire the MGs because we're just as likely to hit ourselves at that point. Um, and we'll just fire standard round. Yeah. Nope, it's over there now. Yes, warriors. Show them what you got. Yeah, let's show them what we got because now. Now you're in the turf of battle armor. <laughs> battle armor Angie. Got it. Four light rifles, here they come. Take this. Quite a few of them hit him. <laughs> so he's gonna go, he's gonna try to do something here. Oh, he's gonna get behind me. Ooh, 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 ow! Yeah, that my mech's coming apart around me. Of course, we lost all our evasion. What did we lose? We lost a jump jet. Not a big deal. Standing by. Not ideal, but not a big deal. I'm actually gonna have this thing move behind this battle armor. Cause I don't I know they can shoot at it. But I don't know that they can do a lot else to my chopper. On my way. Double time. So we're just gonna try to wipe these guys out. Oh. They have one gun. Alright. Locked on. Rear armor. You didn't lock on a shit. You whiff hard. He's gonna go and the locust is gonna get to go. You just love shooting this chopper. How you doing over there? <laughs> Obviously some of these Orders. take a really long time, especially at the beginning, because your units are so inaccurate. This is the way. <laughs> Alright, well you wanted to give me that end, we're just going to shoot at you some more. Uh, back to AP FSDS. Roger that. Hey, yeah, that one hit. Right in there. Yes, Commander. Um, we're gonna do the maneuver for him called fucking cease. As in to be. Got it. No shooting, just running. Uh no, you're gonna shoot too. Alpha on this motherfucker, uh, and hopefully don't shoot anything we like. Oh, come on. Come on, camera. Work with me here. So this is ours, and hopefully we don't hit it. Firing all Reporting well, critical hit. I didn't see any floaties on our own guy. What do you need? So that's good news. And now we're going to move over here. Roger. And make him continue to have the worst kind of day. I hope you like 
machine gun. Aye, aye. Engaging target. Hey, oh, that yeah. cannon fucking hit. Boy, howdy. Commander. Uh, we're going to use Vigilance right off the bat because do need stability. Um, and now we're going to try to punch him in the mouth. Aw, oh, he blew up my meat. Oh, no, wait. I just can't use it when I'm moving, I think. Unless it's just gone. Is it gone? Did I lose a laser? Nope, it's there. Just can't use it. Okay. UI confusion. Moving to position. Locked on for physical attack. Well, he dodged it. And he dodged the missiles. Sick. Missed. Yeah, I saw. I saw you miss, bud. Orders? Honestly, we're just going to leave this guy here and hope that this just blows a man in half. Copy that. Well, not quite in half, but he's not having a good time. On you, Commander. Can we mount him now? A. <laughs> yeah. Re <laughs> they got on. Yes. <laughs> just the boards just murderating <laughs> they're, they're like on his legs they're just like scrambling all over him oh my god i'm trying to see like oh that's him on the other thing i guess our guys are just the, on him now somewhere Ready for order. very funny still very funny although i'm i'm going to do something i'm going to attempt punch one more time and if I accidentally punch one of my own dudes, eh. <laughs> do punch. Yay, we didn't punch our own dudes. We scared him, he ejected. Great death standard armor still in the game. Okay. How many missiles do you have? So many missiles. And how many times does this tank have to shoot you before you just stop it? Oh, he actually can't even get an angle on him now. Yikes. We'll start sending him toward uh, the no Locust. Just running. And then... Waiting for orders. Can we get you into a position where you can see them? If not, well, you aren't going to hit him either. We'll start sending you toward the Locust as well. Going full throttle. Yeah, full throttle. All four steps of it. Start to steal his parts in the middle of combat. Basically, we're just ripping bits of him off. Yeah? Uh, yeah? Fucking this tanker. Yeah? What you want? We'll keep sending her after him, though. We'll hit the grenade launcher again. So we get flares in this area. Negative damage. You weren't supposed to damage him, it's fine. I'm ready for order. Strider, I'm sure you are sick of this commando. Please. Please come over here and end him. Or at least end part of him. Like, just blow something off. Nope. What do I pay? I don't even feel bad that I've shot you once. What can I do for you? Oh, there's the circle of mounting, I guess. Circle of mounting. Really sounds awful. I regret that one. Coordinates received. Well, these guys are just going to shoot rifles at each other now. But have you killed anyone yet? Damn. Not yet. Waiting for orders. What's his move? 15? Uh, we'll move back a little bit because I definitely don't want my Got assassin it. to get mounted. That would be bad. Um, 
Oops, we'll fire those two. Engaging with target. Of course nothing. Hits. Negative damage. Now he's gonna He's gonna do some shit, okay. Our Van Zant militia is just like Yeah, I'm just gonna light all this on fire. Are you all right with that? Internal structure damage. Can you stop, command? Jesus, this guy refuses to die. I'm not sure. As far as like, ooh, chicken taco, that sounds good. Yar har. <laughs> I don't know, Flack, because I am not the smart when it comes to, uh, what's it called? Like, the lore? Are you going to be able to get down? No, probably not. I probably need to keep going this way. We'll, uh, we'll just send him back in here. On my way. Double time. 19, or 18s. Okay. Well, we'll bomb these guys. Locked on. Got more hits than I thought we would, to be honest. Holy shit. That hit something good. What's up, boss? What's up? Ooh! I can see you again! All an ass. So for when we miss, we'll just, you know. Affirmative. Oh! Oh, we didn't miss! Scored a critical hit. Hashtag sick. That's gone. <laughs> we didn't completely miss, I should say. We we mi still missed quite a few things, but it wasn't 100%. Got it. No shooting, just running. Yeah, you just you just you just move. That's it. That's all you're gonna do right now. All right, can you can you please come over here and stop getting shot in the mouth? Because, boy, howdy, have you done that a lot. Fire helps the crops. Fire good. Hey! That was your chest. Bye-bye! <laughs> Strider finally had enough of his bullshit. <laughs> it's just like, you die now. Oh, boy. Where am I going to be able to even drive down? I think there... Might have a chance. I think their armor is stuck in position. Because they haven't done shit. And they have one laser. Can the armor mount the armor? That is the question. No, it cannot. And I'm actually proud of them for not letting that happen. It's like, hey, you guys did a thing properly without a weird glitch. I mean, they do a lot of things properly, to be fair. But it's just admirable to me. Like, oh, cool, you didn't overlook that. <laughs> Just stand still and shoot. Locked on target. Hey, Stop that man died. That yeah, they are they are without anything. Like, they can't see, they can't move. I think they might have deployed in a crater that they can't even get off of. Waiting for orders. So we're just going to shoot these fish in this barrel. Because we can. And also because I have to. It's just, just living. Against all odds, just continuing to live, defying me. If there's one thing tanks are good for, <laughs> it's shooting infantry, I guess. Nice. Got past the armor. Yeah, blew up their last energy go. weapon. These guys are just like standing behind a rock shooting at these dudes laughing. Commencing alpha strike. Yeah, that guy died. <laughs> They're just like bam. Haha. Uh -huh. Good to go. Good to go. Alright, Whirly Bird. Make with the shoot shoot. Acknowledged. 
Oh, that man in died. AC-10 to the chest, just... <laughs> what did the... Oh, they finally moved. They moved and tried to do something, and whatever it was, it was not very effective. Yeah, we'll just... Okay. Moving out. <laughs> All right. Acknowledged. Hey, got him. Enemy that down. man looked down the barrel of a cannon and lost. Order. Now I have to find that locust. It was like in some canyon here. On it. We don't even have a sensor <laughs> reading on him. <laughs> you... <laughs> We have definitely... They have defied Van Zandt long enough. What do you need? It is... Ooh! Buddy Christ. My... My brother in Christ, thank you for the follow. Going full throttle. Good to go. Alright, maybe... Maybe this assassin can actually find Come where on. these dudes are. As we bring all our units back to bear after they just like shoot these guys giggling for a turn and a half. Oh hey, cool. Hella chopter. Well done. I hear ya. Proud of you guys. You you guys definitely get ice cream after this. <laughs> yeah, come on, buddy. It's just you and me now. If I were this pirate, I would be shitting my pants. Like, all my friends got mowed through by some crazy dudes with probably many, 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 many disabilities. Alright. Solid landing. Good to go. Going full throttle. Yep. Yeah, crowbars instead of battle claws, exactly. No one expects to be shot with their own AC-10. I fucking love it. Ready for orders. That's what the hot drop ability is for. I'm just gonna say that's like fucking cargo lobbing extra shit yeah. onto the field. Like, hey, y'all want some extra shit? <laughs> Alright, we're going to do something strange right now. We're gonna flare smoke, or go from flare to smoke and we're going to attack ground in front of our uh, our man here. Roger. So that should should, let's see I don't think I'll see that until I actually look at the terrain data for him. Commander? As we move both these units up, there we go, is it in the... What is it saying for this area? Oh, road smokescreen, there we go. Drastically reduces your sight and visibility, but it'll reduce for him too, so when we pop out the other side, so he's going to take that turn, move up hopefully like a dum-dum, we'll pop out the other side like, gotcha bitch! Ha! Exactly. See, he's just moving up now. Waiting for orders. You guys are gonna have to run real fast if you want to get a shot on him. Uh, you missed more blowing things up, Hammer. As as is tradition. Dude, chicken taco is never bad at any time. Oh my god. Uh, every time I'm streaming, it just turns into a food cast, and I don't mind this. I love it because I am also the hungry. Pretty much always hungry, to be honest. But, you know, whatever. Neither here nor there. Excuse me. Alright, time to do the thing we said we'd do and just, like, peep out the other side of this smoke and be like, ha ha! Here I am. 
Oh wow, okay, that's not great. Firing. Full complement on enemy. No sensor lock. Primary target damage. Just commander. visuals. So he probably had he probably had a bad sensor roll, I would wager. Are we gonna be able to walk across any of this? Uh, oop, oop, come on. Now stay with me, game. All in ass. We'll get him going. We'll lob LRMs in his general direction. Firing. None of them hit. Hoped for a fire, to be honest. Did Man. not get. Yep. Now this. All right. Full speed. Will increase his visibility with the grenade launcher using flares again. Um, probably the best part of this tank, because the heavy rifle doesn't hit often, the machine guns jam constantly, and it doesn't move very far, although it is a fucking beast armor-wise. But now he should be illuminated, and hopefully that makes him easier to hit. Oh yeah, no, we're throwing worms at him! Ooh, grill torque, that sounds good too. Venonator, uh, <laughs> I need you to not die, that's, that's your job today. Position confirmed is try not to get blowed the fuck up. I don't know if you're going to be able to do it. Waiting on you, Commander. Yeah, you guys can just run forward. Go, my little reunits. Go with your legs. Yeah, we're going to we're going to wait with him cuz we need that we need that pirate to move. Yeah, come on. Do something stupid. Do something real dumb. Be a big dumb dumb. Oh no! You hit me with machine guns. What's up, boss? Now is when we eat your face. Except he can. He's not even going to be able to see him. Understood. Moving fast. Good to go. That's fine, because he can. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, biggity, biggity boy. Oh, wow. Okay. He still has something. I didn't think he'd get that much. Uh... Yeah, that's not even worth the shot, to be honest. Good to go. Yikes. We can't really prevent that. We're going to fall back into the fucking smoke. I'm going to jump back into the smoke, actually. Because the last thing I need is him going behind him and making it a problem for me. Yeah? Understood. Yeah, large amounts of indirect fire just kind of doing nothing. Hooray. Again, we will uh, make this area very well lit. Commander? The nice part is if we surround him, hopefully he gets scurred. Let's see here, let's get this unit in optimal range which would be right about there no shooting just running no you're going to shoot don't worry every time you say no shooting you're shooting acknowledge hey in the fucking back like a true militiaman <laughs> just bam done mission successful she finally got tired of being deployed she's like my cockpit's getting cold because of the holes in it let's go home <laughs> <laughs> Everybody gets Dairy Queen. <laughs> oh my gosh. There we go. There we go. That assassination. Woo -wee. All these tiny little units just running around. Well, we shot a lot of bullets <laughs> and we cost ourselves some money there, but we got the we got the propaganda man's. <sighs> Yeah, this, 
assassin have ow now <laughs> excuse me although I'll probably just let that jump jet wither off and I'll uh, I'll, I'll up armor him to be honest all those guys everybody soft serve for everybody always I always want to see a fallout art I like fallout The Pirate Commando. So this was like the really shitty Inner Sphere armor. Oh, this was the Pirate's Bane one. Okay. Oh, this is the Piranha Games Bloodlust Vulcan. Okay, that's interesting too. Cold Steel, thank you very much for that follow. We can actually get a lot of parts of a Pirate's Bane. That would be pretty cool. Pirate Medium Laser. <laughs> awesome. Oh, more Endo Steel. That's nice. And a Guardian... Oh my gosh, that's from the... Uh... That has got to be from the PB. That has got to be from the PB. We are just rolling in some excellent... Excellent, excellent gear right off the start. That is amazing. We're going to pull the doubles. We're going to pull the Dreadnought. We're going to pull the Guardian. We're going to pull the Endo Steel. Holy hell. <laughs> the Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch. Okay. Literally. Literally. The Holy Hand Grenade of Antioch. Uh, <laughs> 30 AOE to units in a 30 meter radius. So if you're standing right next to somebody and it does 10 damage if it hits you. What the hell, game? Alright, then we're going to take one of the PB parts. Because it would be really sick if we got a lot of those. My, literally, my god, yes. All right, we got one, two, three, four of them. So if we fight another Pirate's Bane Locust, we will we will be in some good shape. We also got spare lasers, a spare SRM4. Uh, spare jump jets, I could replace that jump jet. I don't know if I want to. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, cool. Counter missile system. That's, uh, fires, uh, AMS deal... Uh, all right, I think that has to go into an SRM slot, but that's fine. And extra ammo is in case we lose ammo at some point, if we lose a bin or something. Which is weird. It doesn't usually happen unless you just wholesale get blown up. I am winning, Dad. I am Dad. The holy... <laughs> I think I acquired it, Cake. Okay. I think it still made its way in there. I figured it might. I'll look at that in a moment, Cake, uh, because I do... I'm going to let this load out first before I start pressing buttons. Um, come on, Spinnies. You can do it. Mm, there. Bloop. I'll do that myself. Um, all right, so it is the time where I said I would be getting off, um, gonna be done streaming for the day, but thank you guys for joining me for this, for me, East Coast Eastern morning stream. I hope you had fun seeing me kind of do Rogue Tech my way, um, or doing my version of Battletech, because the other guys aren't even playing Rogue Tech, uh, they're playing Battletech Advanced 3062. Oh, I'm going to do that too, Baron. Don't worry. Um, yeah, I, I just hope everybody enjoyed this, kind of seeing the way that I handle uh, Rogue Tech and, and Battle Tech, seeing the way I build mechs, and, and just a nice little, like, Van Zant Militia start. Uh, definitely funny with some of the stuff we got. And like I said, I'll be playing offline with this as well. And uh, so the next time you see this, we might have, like, a whole Lance of mechs. Like, you know, I will come back with it. It's not going to be regularly scheduled. 
with it is just going to be I'll pop in when I can. We'll have some fun. I'll show you kind of the craziness of Rotec and how to build how I build my mechs with like all the gear that you can get in this. And yeah, I hope everybody has an awesome, 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 awesome day. Thank you for joining me. And look forward to some text and depth later uh, in the day where you've got a good good lineup for today. So enjoy your days, enjoy your nights, enjoy your evenings, and toodles. <laughs>